on guys booster whips here I'm gonna be doing a quick video um, in regards to the new Android Auto facelift redesign um, I finally got it there's been some um, different ways on how to get this out but eventually everyone's gonna get it. it's getting pushed out little by little um, I got the update directly from Google Play Store some have gotten it from APK mirror um, so I'll link the the link directly so you guys can download the APK and install it manually and then um, I'll show you the steps real quick um, some of these things are not a uh, automatic you know if you know now if you plug in and have Android Auto set up it automatically pops up on the screen for this update that they're pushing out you gotta go manually and enable it to see the new uh, setup so I'm gonna show you guys real quick what you gotta do and then uh, we'll go ahead and give you a quick overview of how it looks all right guys, so the very first thing you wanna do is um, you open up the app, and if you go to the settings page, uh, here's this option. Once you have the correct update, you'll have the try new auto, um, Android auto, sorry. You wanna go ahead and enable that before um, you go ahead and you connect your uh, USB to the uh, car and the phone itself. The version you wanna go ahead and make sure you have is this version right here 4.5.592854 release um, mm -hmm. like I said some of these things are coming out you know getting pushed out on the uh, Google Play Store but it's coming out like this so you're gonna have to go ahead and uh, do this manually enable this option before you plug it in eventually as you see here um, it says update um, either update now or wait for the automatic update to come soon so once they push that out you don't have to go ahead and enable this uh, manually you'll just go ahead and plug it in and then the interface will show um, so I'm gonna give you guys a little quick um, overview on how it looks I think it's really great really great update everything's bundled together it looks nice um, minimalistic type of style and everything is nice and clean uh, makes the car you know kind of pop out the screen when you're looking at things so it's really nice I think it gives it a great touch. So I'm gonna go ahead and move out to the uh, screen out so you guys can go ahead and see. All right guys, so I went ahead and I plugged it in. I'm gonna go ahead and hit Android Auto. And this is how the new interface looks. Everything is grouped together, so it's really great. So if you have your Navi like Waze and uh, you wanna go ahead and look at your music app, you can go ahead and do that. The interface changed, so now the uh, progress bar of the song is on the play button which is really great and if you want to go ahead and toggle back you have everything within there so it's really great because um, everything is in one screen so that's really awesome you have your notifications on this side and then you have your uh, voice assist here or assistant android assistant which is really great and if you want to go back home um, this is where all your apps are. I thought it was really cool. They integrated the Honda logo on here So I want to assume that all the other cars will have their respective logo that was really great But this is where all your apps are located. So this circle right here when you press it This is all your updated apps that are available for you to use um, If you have Pandora or any other one it will also show up here Google Maps or whatnot. So um, Really cool and uh, but that's just basically it you know it's really nice that you can go ahead and have multiple um, apps running within the same screen and bar and it's really great anyways guys um, I hope you guys like the video if you have any questions comments go ahead and drop them below like I said um, a lot of the people are getting the update directly some of them are downloading APK mirror um, but the steps are basically very very similar you have to go ahead and enable it manually like I showed on the previous clip and then that's it you just go ahead and you set everything up plug it in just like normal and you'll have this new interface for Android Auto and that is all thanks for watching guys uh, once again like share and subscribe as always and until next time boost the whips I'm out have a very pleasant day